episode of Super Reaction Bros. I'm Kristen. I'm Christopher. And on today's episode, we're taking a look at the official Red Band trailer for Nobody. No, that's the name of the movie. Nobody. No. Okay. Yeah, that's it. All we're going to get that for you. Copyright. So, it stars Bob Odenkirk as a, just a bystander who helps a woman, and it turns out that woman's involved with some drug lords, and now the guy's involved with the said drug lords. Who has PTSD. Yes. Uh... Interesting who's working on this. It's coming to us from the director of Hardcore Henry mm -hmm. and being written by a guy we just saw his more recent stuff coming up. The writer, the one of the writers for the three for the three of John Wick films. Mm -hmm. So this is very interesting. Yeah. Considering it's Bob Odenkirk. He who, plays a guy who just wants to be left alone and he somehow gets involved with, of saving somebody, but the people he pretty much takes on is connected to a drug cartel. So now it's like That's why he said. No, you didn't fully dive deep into it. Um, yeah, because I wanted to see the trailer. You want to be bitch slapped, don't you, right now? All right, let's just dive into this so I can shut him up for the official trailer for Nobody. So here we go. Because he just wanted that normal life. He wanted but, to have a normal life and but he then, wanted to have a family. But then everything. So it's coming rushing back to him. Everything comes rushing back to him. And now he's just like, fuck it. And this is where he gets involved. And 
Holy crap! I didn't think by the end of this I was saying Bob Odenkirk's gonna be an action movie badass by the end of it. Holy shit, man. It grabbed the idea of the equalizer, if you think about it, where it's like if somebody yeah. who just doesn't want to be. He doesn't want to be bothered. He just wants to live his life it's, here. It's been done so many... I know. I know what you're saying. It's yeah. been done a whole bunch of times. Well, kind of in a way. It's just that, in the ma again, like you said, you can. Co it's a matter of when you copy and paste it, it's on how you're telling the story. That's how you do it. It's like, can you tell it good enough to grab people's attention going, holy shit, what the fuck did I just watch? You know, that's, yeah. what, it, that's and what this is. Said, and it comes to us from the guy behind the John Wick And film. you can tell. You yeah. can really tell. You can tell that he pretty much... He wanted to make somebody that's like... You look at this person, it's like, you don't, they look, and Bob Odenkirk fits that role. He looks like that type of person. It's like, that's a, somebody's like, you, you know, it's like, oh, that's a nobody. It's just a dad. You know, it's a simple. It's a good casting. It is a really good It's casting. a good casting because it's, it's like you have to find somebody, you know, that, that you look at going, that's, that's nobody. You know, that's somebody you don't really see. Expect, what, what's work, what works is that. You know, from the TV series, you know, that he works on, you know, calling, calling Saul. Better it's, Call Saul. Better Call Saul. You know, it's like. It's like he plays this ordinary type of guy. It's like he fits that role. That's why I think they chose the perfect. I think it, that's to me. It's like the story is is great, but they're like we need to find that person, perfect person you look at and fits that nobody role. Somebody that you look at going, that is a nobody. You know, that's somebody that says a typical dad or something like that. You know, you know, and and I think what it is because they like I said a lot of the. The, the, the story descriptions online, they said PTSD. And I think the whole PTSD thing is that he's holding it in. Mm -hmm. That's what it is. It's like it's, he doesn't want to bring back up those memories. That's what, what it is. You know, so, you know, and what's perfectly too, even that spot where it's like, you know, when somebody's robbing his house or something like that, it's like, like, why didn't you swing at him or something like that? Because it's like he didn't want to get involved. You know, it's like you can see why. <clears throat> and I like it how his family didn't even know, know his past at all, not even his wife. It's like he th does not know about his past at all, and man, that line just delivered. <laughs> Can you pack that kitty cat, cat bracelet? bracelet. <laughs> as they said, they said, it's like the writers are like, we involved the puppy. You don't want to kill this man's puppy. Now it's like you taking this girl's kitty cat bracelet. <laughs> it's like what the fuck. So I am definitely gonna be watching. this I'm definitely gonna be checking this out. Holy well. shit, man. I mean, if nobody else is reacting to this, you better start reacting to this now, because it's like, holy crap, this was fantastic. I, w I definitely want to that. That would be awesome if they have this in the same world, just for the fun of it, as John Wick. But if not, it's okay. It works perfectly on its own. But this is still fun and exciting. This is just hilarious. Oh, man, I can't wait, wait to watch this. So, other than that, if you're new to the channel, you can hit the like button. If you want to talk to us more about stuff like this, comment down below. If you want to share us around, share it around. And if you like a... It's just a little bit more than anybody else when it comes to talking about films like this. Hit the subscribe button down below and hit that bell icon as well. Let us know what you guys thought of this trailer overall. Was it something that it really hit you out of nowhere? Like, it did with us. Like, it kind of did with us. You know, that you're not seeing this type of actor or him dive into a role like this where it's like full-on action mode. You know, becoming an action star in this film. I mean, let us know in the comments down below. Uh... Put down what you are most excited for this film. Is it because of the story or just because you just want to see this actor kick some serious ass? I mean, oh my god, he just does an awesome job. Let us know. Put down what you thought of our reaction, but most importantly, thank you for watching. So until next time, I'm Kristen. I'm Christopher. And this has been a very nobody-filled episode of SRB. I was about to say, just feel like kitty cat bracelet filled. Yeah. <laughs> see ya. Later. Hey guys, thanks for watching. If you want to check out our previous reactions, or any one of our other SRB shows, check out one of our playlists down below. And if you want to check us out in the social universe, you can find us on Twitter and Stardust at Super React Bros.